Hey everyone, it's me Sam, and I am doing a video that I have talked about two separate times, but I've not yet done because I am a lazy mofo. Just kidding, I've been working. But anyway, I am doing the bean box. This is for last month. It's been sitting up here for like the past month, month and a half because, um, I really haven't had the time, or I've forgotten, or kind of both. But, um, so basically Beanbox is this coffee place over in Seattle, Washington, which is basically 350 miles to the west of me. And so they send you this box of like four different flavors, and so I tried one. And so now I'm going to talk about it. I haven't tried any yet, simply yet, because at this moment, I do not have a coffee pot or a grinder. They actually ship the boxes in the bags of coffee, actually whole bean. You have to grind them first. Um, so I don't have anything to grind it with quite yet. I probably will for my birthday when I... My birthday's next month, so I'll probably ask for like a bunch of good Target gift cards, and you know, so that way I can go get it, go get some. But um, my so right now I'm gonna talk about these. So basically, since you for it, this is the trial box. It only took two days for shipping to get here because Seattle really isn't that far from here. So, so we open up, you get this. And so it tells you to brew it like you mean it. Tips and tricks for the coffee perfection. If you grind it. You grind right before you do it. And then um, you brew it with any coffee pot. You smell it, drink it. For um, You smell it and then you kind of drink it. And then you fall in love with the roast. And then you can order more if you want. And they encourage you to order it because they... Um, because some of it's limited edition. And so here is the other side and it basically lists the flavors. And so we got Kuma Coffee, uh, Her Herc Miner Coffee, uh, Lighthouse Roasters, Fine Coffees, and Conduit, or Conduit, I don't know. And um, the one, so, right, let's go talk about this. So the first one we got is the Karma Coffee, and it is um, known for the precision roasting. Karma Coffee has won num uh, numerous awards for their coffee. Their Gu Guatemala uh, Hanapu features notes of toffee, Fresh cream and caramel apple, uh, caramel candy apple. So, I like the smallest one. It does have like a sweet, like a sweet thing to it. Oh, you can smell it right here. But um, I think it's all like that. Yeah, it's all like that. So it, it does have a sweet one. I think this might be a. It also says, caramel apples aren't just for kids. This smooth, rich coffee is a grown-up version of the classic summer treat. Carnival not included. You have to provide your own. So, is it supposed to smell like a caramel apple? Or it tastes like caramel apple? I don't know. It actually is, it does have a, like a, a sweet, a sweeter smell to it. So, and then there's... Her Kim Her Coffee. It's a drip blend. It's soft, refreshing, light acidity with a clean fresh hint of cherry with a deep, deeply caramelized sugar and chocolate, velvet mouthfeel and weight. Directly sourced from El Kedra and El Kio in Honduras, and it says chocolate, sugar, cherry. Try this roast without sugar or milk, or milk or sugar if grains its own. 
it smells like coffee to me. <laughs> um, I mean, I think this is something I'm going to have to try. I... I'm indifferent to this one, so... Then we've got, um... Roast, uh... Lighthouse Roasters. Fine choice, fine coffees. Roasters choice. A full body blend of Ethiopian, Sumatran, and Latin high growth Arabics. Rich and complex, Roasters choice touches the whole palate and stays clean. Our signature coffee. A bold roast with a real kick, but polished and refined, like a gentleman. This one is, I think this one might actually be a little bit darker, because it has a stronger taste to it. it not a stronger taste, but a stronger smell to it than the other two. So this might be a little bit darker. And, and it does have that, it does have that stronger smell, stronger, like a bold taste, smell to it. And then this one is conduit, and um, says it's the Papua New Guinea Rika Rika, a full cup of nice round fruit. Brewing with the, with the cinnamon mix reveals some nice but Republican cherry and earthy tea notes. A great coffee to roll in the spring blossoms. Call it an identity crisis gone right. This coffee exhibits all the bold, bold character of a dark roast, but subtle fruit and flora notes reveal its light profile. A unique single origin experience. And this one. I believe this is the one I like to actually like the most. Of all the smells. So, this one does have a bold, very dark smell to it too. Uh, I think, honestly, out of the ones that I really want to try the most is probably this one. But, um, and then also, you get a little pamphlet that says, um, Welcome to Beanbox. I only kept it for one month to try. It says, Keep the coffee coming. We'll send you a monthly selection of the best coffees from Seattle Top Roasters. In fact, we've already handpicked four limited editions for your next box. And then it says, Get a monthly, want more coffee, get a 12 ounce of your roast bake tailored to your roast preference, light, medium, or dark for 20 bucks a month. Update your beat your subscription at beanbox slash account. And so that's all in the box. There was also some candies that were in there earlier. Um, it comes from Seattle. It takes like I live in Spokane, so it, there's only it only takes like two days to get here. Not long at all. But anyway, tell me what you guys' thought is. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.